it has not been a big advantage to her to serve here in the last uh, 30 minutes. Yeah, it's been fun watching that backhand drop shot of Zvonareva. We've seen three distinctly different ones. The one where the two hands stay on the whole time, the two hands stay on most of the time, and then the one hand throughout. <laughs> it's really pretty outstanding to have that kind of flexibility and variety on that side. Has had such trouble holding serve. Remember, she served for the first set at 5 3, lost her serve, then finally won a serve game in that set, but didn't win a serve in the second set. And through the first eight, nine games of the match, we're saying, why isn't Venus able to, to yep. gain a little traction more on her delivery? Seeing some emotion now from Zwanareva. I think she's saying, don't lob this six foot one athletic, agile. Go for the pass, but from that position, I really don't know. Or maybe she's saying, throw it up even higher. Venus always makes me nervous, though, with the smash. She, she really turns side on quickly and can catch and miss time her smashes. Again, you, she's been very emotive here lately. Elena Dementieva is watching this, and Monareva uh, very, very unhappy about this outcome. Billie Jean King, as here is a break of serve again, and it is three games to one now. She still cannot find a way to hold serve. Well, she collapsed on the ground like that against Dementieva didn't quite show this much emotion and disgust as her coach looks on, a coach who has seen the evolution of Zvonareva. This is the old Zvonareva. She is really in tears right now and trying to regain her composure. Yeah, let out a little steam and then get it back. disguise your true colors for a while but sooner or later they, they do come bursting out again don't they what, what do you mean what do you mean by that <laughs> well because talk about the, her history well that's... containing the emotions is not something that's come but easily that's what she's been trying to do here I, I, exactly but but still you go back to who you are often when it's at its most tense and in the biggest match of her career this is when it's at its most tense and Zavana Reva is losing it right now. Yeah, of course, there are always two sides to the story. I'm not sure that there's much that Zavana Reva can do at this stage because Venus Williams is really playing. Here's a challenge, and that did tip the line. And that, that the show of emotion, the way Zavana Reva just cracked there would give Venus even more of a reason to 
throw back her shoulders, spread her wings, and sail to the finish line. Once upon a time, Venus showed a lot of emotion like that, too. I can remember Venus on the center court at Wimbledon losing it against Novotna emotionally when she lost her beads on the court and had a point taken away against Davenport in the quarters of the Australian. And I think it was 99. She crumbled there. But she learned. Learned well enough in this match to have a 4-1 lead that still represents just one break. For Svandareva, though, the issue is trying to hold serve. It's all coming out for Zavana Raven. And the change of ends, sometimes if you cover your head in a towel and kind of do some real thinking about how to regain it, you can. But I don't know, against an opponent like Venus Williams, who's won so many big titles before, this is looking pretty grim for the Russian, who is a surprise finalist here. Let's face it, a stunner. Well, that's a great point from Zvonareva, and I'm happy to see her emotion wishing away. We could see some more emotion from players at the top of this tennis world, but the problem for her is not so much her own desire. It's what to do against Venus Williams, who is flying really high now. Well, from our standpoint, when you call matches, it certainly brings in a great element. When you see the raw emotions and the, and the care and the desperate desire to win, or to not fail. This will be her first hold since 5-6 in the first set. What's the difference, uh, what's the difference, the desire to win and the desire not to fail? Well, one tends to be a little more positive, the desire to win. I think that that player w will go for it and be aggressive and not be afraid to take chances, where being afraid to lose tends to be a more cautionary approach. Play better when you're down. 4-1. Got a game, Kuzmana Reva as she holds, and just down one service break in the championship match, third set. And, and Venus's serve has really held steady the last you know, set and a half, two sets. She's only had one or two little stumbles in that first set. She obviously, well, she lost serve early in this set. It didn't really matter at the time, but now the pressure is really on Venus. She's within two games of winning this title, the last match of the year on the tour. But Zvonareva had 5-2 first set, and since then has held serve once in the match until this last game. Just a decisive, brilliant start to the game. <laughs> that set play of hitting the serve to a spot, either up the tee or out wide, and then blast away. <laughs> Pace of serve is certainly picked up. <laughs> 